All right guys, so uh, superset does not mean that you have to go super fast or that this is for time. It simply means that we're gonna have two exercises put together and you're gonna do them back to back for three sets. So I'll do a set of step ups, a set of GHD sit ups, and that's one superset. So that'd be one superset, three sets. All right, crew. So just a few thoughts from looking at this week of programming for the Barbell Club and going forward. Um, squats. So it gives you a percentage. I want you to try to use that percentage. Uh, we did our one rep maxes before. You should know roughly what your one rep max is. Um, we're training at a sub-maximal weight. We're trying to build up a base layer. As we go forward, months on the road, we're gonna build back towards the one rep max again. But right now, we're gonna stay on those percentages. So you use the same one rep max that you set before when it gives that percentage. If it does not give a percentage, like on day two, we have pressing and there's no percentage, that's when you can increase the weight. You can go a little heavier each set. You can try to um, see what you can do each week. Um, when I'm looking at the movements that are the accessories, the weighted step ups, um, the GHG step ups, the reverse hyper, the beta good morning, all these movements, um, I want you to try to work those at weights or movements that you can get the full 10 reps or the full whatever the set is um, comfortably. That you can do that. It's not you're not breaking down the movement. You're not having to give sketchy form in order to hit that rep. If it's hard for you and you can't do it yet, scale the movement, scale the weight a little bit. So we have ring dips, we have strict pull-ups. These are things that I know everybody is not able to do yet with good form. I want these to be strict. I want you to work on the technique. I want you to work on holding a good position with your body. And those are things that are going to make you better. Um, our Olympic days, our Wednesdays and our Saturdays. Right now, I don't care how much weight you're lifting. It doesn't matter. You're not setting a PR on a complex of three snatch deadlift, two snatch pulls and a snatch. So that means, again, I want you to think in your head, how perfect can I make these reps? Even if you only use... 50% of your one rep max or 40%. It doesn't really matter because right now all of us are at a point where we need to work our technique and we're not in a competition at the gym on a Wednesday evening. We're there to get better and we get better by getting our technique better. Now when we go for one rep max at the end of the cycle or we go to a competition, those are times that we really want to push it and we may, our technique may break down a little bit, but when we're training, and when we're working at sub-maximal weights, we want to be cautious of keeping our technique solid and trying to get better in perfect positions. If you guys have questions going forward on any of that, or something doesn't make sense to you that we're doing, please ask me about it right in the group. If you write it in the group, everybody can see it and that way we can all get better. Maybe some people have the same questions, but I want to use it as a forum that we can all use to keep track, keep us accountable, and push going forward. 